Hey kiddos, welcome back to Resident Evil or Biohazard, whichever you prefer. When we left off yesterday, uh, I kind of copped out a little bit and <laughs> rebooted some. And also, um, well, it was a really crappy, short episode really, wasn't it? But it was a Sunday. I had been at work, so I couldn't really help it. It's not my fault. Anyway, <laughs> here we are back. And I, I still don't really know know what I'm doing exactly, but I'm just gonna have to to to, to go for it. Um, <laughs> we've already done this bit uh, once, so I could in theory skip it, but I'm not going to because I don't think I really did it properly because I was already kind of panicking about whether I'd screwed up or not. One thing I do know, though, like I said uh, yesterday, yesterday's episode, I did do a lot of... I hear that. I hear that. Oh! Oh! How did I know? I, I said this yesterday. He would be back because... <sighs> because I didn't kill him. <laughs> right. Well, I know I don't need to go in that direction, is what I was just about to say. Because all those doors are locked. So let's just uh, sneak on past. I was just saying, I did some reading as well. I said this yesterday. So I've got a few hints and tips about things that I can and can't do. Like, I think I can actually search Kenneth's body. And he's got something on him. Yes. It's the film that belongs to Kenneth. The film... That we saw at the beginning when he was searching the helicopter? Or does he like to take a copy of, I don't know, Starstruck out with him? Or Starstruck? Not Starstruck. Star, Stardust is what I was thinking of. Uh, well, you know, he's thrown. Okay. He's probably going to get up at some point as well. Anybody who's ever bitten by a zombie always gets up. Anyway. Right. So I've got a few hints and tips. Just a few. I've tried not to ruin too much for myself, but you know, just just enough for me to get by. <laughs> kind of. And, you know, not screw up. Ooh, mirror. Ah! Ah! I did not know about that, though. I was just waiting for the cue on the cage again. Oh, swish! Let's get that herb too. Get that herb too. There we go. Get that herb. Duh. Duh. I'll combine it straight away as well. Because I want to keep some slots free in my inventory. Apparently this is a very important thing. To keep slots free in your inventory. So that you can collect things. That happen during cutscenes apparently. You know. If that's how it works. That's how it works. Like I have no idea whether I'm supposed to be carrying everything I've got with me still. Or if there's a way of dropping things, or he's totally, he, he's he lying in a different position than he was the first time we came in here. I'm going to have to check back about that. Can I search him at all? There's a corpse collapse. Oh, I did do this already, didn't I? Yeah, I've seen that already. So much happened in this mansion, Jill. So much happened. These are very rickety loud stairs. That's not very comforting. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let let the go. Okay. Yes. There's herbs here as well. Can you com can when you've already combined two herbs? Can you combine the two combinations of the two herbs? I think you can. But let's find out like I can I combine no never mind I thought I could I can't <laughs> alright went this time last time this way oh there's the one in the mirror he is definitely walking somewhere I definitely hear footsteps is he coming towards me Sounds like they're getting la you he's getting nearer. I 
And now he's walking away again? Okay. Fair enough. Alright, I know that... I know there's nothing I can do in here, but... That is only the beginning. Seriously. I know there's nothing I can do in here, but... At least I don't think there is. But I just want to have another look, just in case I missed something. Like, is there a different spot I can... I can run to to hide? I mean, I know as soon as this starts moving it... Oh, hello. Hang on. What's in here? Oh. Do I want to be doing this yet? Am I jumping ahead of myself? It's locked. An emblem of a helmet. Well, that's a new one. I've only had sword and, ar uh, sword and shield armor so far. Okay, okay. Well, no, I'm not taking the key because I know what will happen if I take the key. And uh, oh, no, don't walk into the spikes, Jill. That's a very bad idea. Very bad idea. All right, so I know I can't do anything there. I've already died once in there. Don't want a repeat of that. <laughs> so, I guess my only other option is to go the way this zombie is blocking for me, which is great. Oh, hello, sir. I know there's probably better ways of doing this, but uh, can I go through that door? Nope. Box from the other side, okay. He's probably going to get back up. I'm totally aware of this, but... Eh. Yeah. What's this? Okay. Oh, crap, my inventory's full now. Will this add to the ones I already have? Oh, it will, sweet. Okay, cool. I wasn't sure about that. If it was going to want its own slot or if I could uh, combine it, that's cool. What is this all over the floor? Oh no, there's two doors now. Does he know where I am? Is he still following me? Does not appear so. Which is good. Well, I suppose they would have a rubbish memory, wouldn't they? Right, which door do I want? Um, eeny meeny miny mo, catch a bird bad so if it's wheels, let it go, eeny meeny miny mo. I unlocked it? With what? Oh, the lockpick. Lockpick. Duh. Do I want to go in here? Do I want to be in here? Do I want to go in here? Oh, hello, sir. You're going to be coming towards me, aren't you? So I'm going to go this way. Is that the door I came in? Or is this a different door now? Oh no, this is... What is this? Yes! And it won't take up one of my eight inventory slots because it's a defensive item, right? That's right, that's right. I hope. Double door. Oh, am I in the room above the room I was before, uh, below before? Is that a mannequin? Or a statue? It is. Oh, it's such a disconcerting noise. Like, I might love the films, but I think I may be a little bit too afraid to be immersed in the world. <laughs> I tell you, it's going to ruin it for me. It's going to ruin it for me. Oh! Oh! I know where I am. I don't think I want to be in it yet. Do I? I feel like there's probably still some more to explore through here. So let's not uh, go too far. Look at this. What's... Right, she's holding... Oh, hello. She's holding something. How can I get that from her? I'm going to have to kill this guy, aren't I, really? In truth. Can I get through this door? Emblem of a sword. Okay, no. I don't have that one. What's this? Stained glass window. Resembles a woman. Like her? She's definitely holding something in her hand. That's definitely going to be important. I know Capcom games. 
There's no more door. Oh, hang on, look. There's a thing I can push. It. He's right here, isn't he? He is right there. Maybe I should kite him around the other side. Oh, no, he did go around the other side. Clever boy. Oh, well, not really. No, 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 you want to pull him. Pull her. There you go. That's the one. Get her in front of the gap. Oops. Go on. Hurry up. Don't know how far away the zombie is. Really? It's not just tipping over the edge already by now? There we go. Alright, that's that done. And to that is totally the room that's down there, right? Okay, so... Let's go find out if... Well, obviously it's broken our hand and I'm going to get the gem. That's going to be the mechanic, isn't it? Let's go find out. What, what did we get, Jill? What magical item did we receive from doing that? And where the hell is Barry? The camera angle changes in this are disconcerting. <laughs> Alright, what does this camera angle do for us? Uh, not camera angle. What is this blue gem about, eh? Is this zombie going to fall from the roof at me? Not the roof, the floor above. What's this? Do I have space for it? I don't have space for it! Crap! See? I told you I'd read something that said that having space for items was important. Oh well, the man. <laughs> All right, let's go try the other door upstairs. Every time that door thing happens, I'm paranoid something's just gonna, well, happen. Like I played, I played Dino Crisis, and I'm pretty sure that actually I think it happened in Resident Evil 2 as well. Is it two or is it one time when I watched my brother play this one? But yeah, and during that cutscene where that happens, it can happen that it opens and it's not just black, but there's something there. And that's not a very pleasant thing to experience. Wh which side is he on this time? I'm not running into him, am I? No. Okay. He's over on the other side again. Yeah, whatever. Suit yourself. <sighs> Let's go try the other door now. The door on the other side. Meanie. Ah, oh, come on. Where do I want to go then? Shut up. Where do I want to go? I may have to... Let's try some of the doors in the main hall. But then I may have to um, cheatsy doodle just a little bit. And uh, is that a door there? Or is it just a cupboard? No, it's just a cupboard. And I may, or I may have to cheatsy doodle and um, <laughs> look up a guide. Sorry. Let's try some of these doors. So maybe there's more I can unlock with the lockpick. Like, for example. Nope. Okay. Don't worry, it's just my own reflection. Yeah. Uh-huh. That's, that's an armor one, okay. Noted. Okay. This isn't going very well already, to begin with. Wait, this one opens now? Do I want to go out here? Out in? Actually, I don't even know if it's out or it. What the hell is that noise? Is it just the moth up around that thing there? Please say it's just the moth that's up around that thing. Do I want to be out here yet? I feel like outside is like the major progression into worseness. It usually is in these games. So do I want to be out here? Uh, I have the distinct feeling that no. <laughs> I don't. But nothing's happened yet. Oh, gravestones? Really? 
Zombie game and there's gravestones. Are you kidding me? I hear wolves as well. Oh wait, there's actually zombie dogs. It's probably just them. Watch from the other side. How the hell do you open a gated off area? Who locks it and climbs back out? There's probably a door in there, I suppose. I don't think I want to do this. But, uh... Sure, why not? Oh, that's just a horrible angle. It just connotes so much badness. Tomb engraved with the picture of an angel. Hang on. Arrow. Arrow! Salmon? Hello? The arrowhead looks like it can be removed. Do that. Okay. Here we go. Progress! I have a slight... Parad Ooh, peridot! Peridot! No, don't do that again. Thank you. That's not what I meant for you to do. There we go. Peridot, huh? Oh wait, hang on. Will it do it automatically? Or do I have to go into the menu and press use? Old school! <laughs> Now what does this do? That doesn't even fit. Square, square peg in a round hole. Oh. Oh. Do I want to go down there? Well, right now it's my only choice, so... How exactly did Jill reach up to fit that in? She probably stood on the stones, I suppose. What the hell is that noise? Okay, no, not fun, not... Scares. Why do these tombstones have faces? Oh, come on, that's just eerie. Stone statue with a hole where the eyes should be. Just the one hole? Where the eyes should be? Sorry. <laughs> I'm wondering if that's where these the, the blue gem will go. Or maybe in there. What the hell is wrong with him? Was he can particularly fond of oral activities when he was alive. Stones actually with holes where the eyes, nose and mouth should be. Okay. Nope, nothing interesting about this one. Oh wait, there we go. Stones actually with a hole where the nose should be. Stone statue with a hole where the mouth should be. That's... That's just creepy. Hella creepy. And I'm really surprised there are no zombies down here. This seems like prime real estate. For some... What? I thought this was a zombie game, not a Dracula game. What? Oh. I see a thing here I can grab. If I grab this, that thing opens, right? This is a booby trap. Book is fitted perfectly in the indentation. Um. No. No, -uh. cause, cause, cause. No, I, I can totally see what's going to happen there. I'm not. No. Nah, -uh. more reading is 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 in is is in store in need. More reading will be done because I'm not touching that book. Book of curses, really. Ah, ah, ah! It's not happening. No, it's not. It's not. I'm leaving. You can close that door because I'm probably not going to come back for a while. I'm outy. Legging it. Is there anything of interest out here? And when I say interest, I do not mean something that could kill me. What? I don't have a shotgun. It's just kind of take up, taking up some space. But 
suppose I should really, because when I get my shotty, that will be very, very handy to have the shells, I suppose. I hope there's a place in this game where you can, like, store items. Like an ender chest. Because I think D Dino Crisis had that. I'm pretty sure. You could store items in boxes, and it wasn't just the one box. It's like you could, you could find it again in other boxes as you found them. So I hope that's a thing. I'm not saying... I'm, right, okay. You can, you can scream at me all you like in the comments. Shut up, Moth! If I'm supposed to be taking the Book of Curses, but I'm not touching it just now until I've done some more reading or I know a little bit more about what kind of situation I'm in. I mean, I know what kind of situation I'm in, but you know what I mean. Okay, so where do I actually want to go next then? Because maybe that is actually what I'm supposed to do to get the progression in the game. But, uh, nah. Not until I understand a little bit more about what's going to happen if I do. Move, chill, 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 move. Oh wait, hang on, I was running into a wall, sorry. Couldn't tell. Does this door work? No I don't! No I don't! I don't wonder at all. I'm, co I'm completely fine with not knowing and I want to leave before it comes up here. Because it can smell my human fleshy bits that it might want to feast upon. Okay, right. Um, well, I know the map says the front door can be opened. It says the front door's blue. But nah, that's not happening either. Because I know that the dogs are out there. I know that much already. So. Oh god, I hope the zombie that's in here hasn't clipped through that dresser. That would be unfortunate. Although it would be quite entertaining if he was actually still there. Slowly, because you don't want to walk right into him. The dress has moved! I can hear him walking though. He doesn't know I'm here. Oh, no, nope. well maybe he does. Does he still have a knife in his head? No, he doesn't. He's pulled that out. Good lad. He can't get past that, right? Even though it's moved. Well, he's not even going to try and slip through that little gap, is he, I suppose? <laughs> I think this one needed a key, so... Yeah, right. Shut up. I still don't have room. I thought after getting rid of that arrowhead, I'd have room in my inventory to pick up the blue gem. But I don't. Oh, I know what I can do, actually, quick. Reload a little bit. Oh, wait. Is this the kind of game that... No, right, it only took up as many bullets as I actually needed. Oh, I suddenly, suddenly had the thought that this could be, because with it being an older game, that it might have used a whole magazine just for a half reload. Oh, that was scary than most of the things I've actually experienced so far. <laughs> Alright. Okay. All right, you're only having a, a minor heart attack, Jester. Don't worry about it. Don't you worry your not-so-pretty little head about it. Okay, so I actually have no idea where I'm going. So, but we are at time anyway, so I'll figure it out off camera so that I'm not wasting your precious time and mine to an extent. <laughs> Thank you for watching, kiddies. I've been Jesse. You've been awesome. This has been Resident Evil or Biohazard, whichever you prefer. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you like what you see and you want to see more. Sometimes I wonder why you would. But I'm having fun, so that's the important part. <laughs> and I will see you through the week.